girl Nikki Miami, and I'm back to show you another hairstyle that I got on my sleeve. But before we go ahead and get started, the hairstyle, you know I gotta shout out to all everybody who been rocking with me since day one, who still subscribe to my channel, who show me mad love. Cause like for real, for real, you already know how I feel about y'all. I love y'all, okay? If you also new to my channel, you just seen my video for the first time. You know what I'm saying? Much love to you. I appreciate it from the jump. Bam. So this hairstyle is going to be very easy and very quick. Um, it's going to be just a crisscross method on one side, a swish on the other side going to the back for a ponytail. Okay, so you see I'm just doing a rubber band method parting. You know how that go already. I'm going to go ahead and spread to you a little bit more just in case it's your first time actually seeing a rubber band crisscross method. Okay, now this hairstyle came out, I say in 2017. But it wasn't like popular like that, so now it came back around from TikTok and all that other stuff. So everybody wanna get in this way. I want everybody to have style very cute, and I like how it looks at the end. So you know me, I gotta finesse it too. Like I gotta get my feet in. Like yeah. <laughs> yeah. Basically, I'm just gonna go ahead and party just like so because party and zig that zig that I'm sorry, party and crisscross method is everything. It's the key to life. Without them parts being right, it would not go. So I'm gonna go ahead and part like the first two and start to put rubber bands on it and make sure you put gel on the end of the hair that way when you crisscross it, it could be sticky, it could be laid down flat. And I just take the one from the top and put it to the one to the back and then put rubber band on it and then. Bam, it's cute just like that. Oh, I'm using colorful rubber bands today because it made the hairstyle more litty, it make it more popping, it make it show more. The black rubber bands that I be using, I found no interest in them at all anymore. So I'm gonna use the rubber bands with the color because I am a what color person and I love my mad lady skin. And that's a different story. But basically, it's how you go ahead and do it. And I'm gonna let the cameras roll. I'm going to come back to you guys and show you the rest of what I'm doing. So, please stay tuned because it's going to be very, 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 very worth the wait. So baby girls, now we on station number two. Now this method right here is very, very important. And if you saw my videos before, you know this how I do my gel. What I do is basically I just part my hair in sections and I take gel and put it in between my hair and I take sprints and I just do it all over, all over because it allow my hair to lay down more proper, it be more flatter and it be more silkier and it just be more cute, you feel what I'm saying? So it have it like snatch laid down to the gods. But yeah, I do this all over, and I'm gonna go ahead to the back and do it also the same thing. Now, I'm gonna part my hair across from ear to ear. I'm gonna go ahead and put my ponytail first. Now, I do the ponytail first in the back because my hair is very short, as you can see. You know what I'm saying? It's no secret with that there. I'm gonna put my hair in a ponytail. Bam, you see it right there. Okay, and then once that's in the ponytail, I'm gonna go to my front and I'm gonna go ahead and tackle my front. So I want my hairstyle to be right now as a swoosh from the side going to the back. You know my hair short, again it is short, you know what I'm saying? So we gotta do what we gotta do to make it work. You see how I lay down flat? Cause the gel already between my hair making it work like that there. And basically I'm just gonna put my hair from the side all the way to the back just like so. Make it flat down. I'm gonna come around, brush it, and put it in the ponytail. So it's gonna be one ponytail, but with two scrunchies, that's just for now. And once that's in a ponytail like that there, next up, you're gonna go ahead and then put, I got to be, glue on it. It's a lot, yes it is a lot, but my hair need it, because uh, my hair tends to have flyweight if I don't like 
make it work if I don't mold it together. So this gel right here, it really works for me and I still love it. Bam, that thing up. You see I had it in two points or well, one point table but two scrunchies. I'm taking it out right now. I'm gonna go ahead and only take it and put it only on one scrunchie because sometimes it hurt. My edges right here is not the real thing. I'm just taking them out right now. That way when it's time to go ahead and finesse them, they'll be cute. This right here is good. It's good money. Y'all should try it out. I'm gonna put a name at the bottom of the screen. But what it do is it just like hide my not bald spot. <laughs> so I'm saying, but it made my hair a little more fuller. Like it like blend in more. It made the hairstyle more better. Just how I feel about it. I'm gonna go ahead and put my nightcap on. I'm gonna come back and do my ponytail.